What's up everybody? Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your lat pull down into a seated cable row. So not a lot of lat pull down machines come with a seated cable row. So what I did with mine, and I've had this machine for about a year and a half, and I've absolutely disliked the fact that it didn't have a low row attachment to it. So I went to Home Depot today and purchased a couple items to help make this into a low row. It's going to be a do-it-yourself low row or seated cable row. So the items that I purchased today are going to be a plastic covered rope and it's just metal wire and it's plastic covered right here so that way uh, you don't cut yourself on it. And then some clamps, which are these clamps that I have right here. And that just helps you close up right here so that way you can attach a carabiner onto it. So what I've done is I haven't, I've done this side, I haven't done this side yet. I'm going to show you guys this. And then I also want to show you guys this bottom piece. So the way that I'm going to have this set up is that wire is going to come right there. It's going to attach to that carabiner. It'll come down to there. So right here I have one of these Husky straps. And this is just a Velcro strap. And I believe it's rated at 300 pounds. And then I've got my carabiner and my pulley. So what eventually I'm going to do is this cord it's going to go through the pulley system. It's going to be attached to that. And then I will be able to be seated right here where my foot is. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that clamp set that I just showed you, and I'm going to go ahead and pull this together down here and clamp this. So remember, this is important because this is the piece that your carabiner is going to go onto and your attachment as well. Two hours later. All right, so now that I put the clamps on there, you see that they're on there nice and tight. I got the carabiner hooked up to the pulley and then the rope in the pulley system. So now, should be ready to go. All right, so I just finished up my main lift of the day. Now I'm going to use the cable low row, so let's go. Let's see it. All right, so that's the first time that I loaded up. I think I, had, I have 120 pounds on there. It's pretty solid. Uh, the Velcro on that Husky strap didn't budge at all. And I mean, it feels pretty sturdy. The only thing that I didn't realize was how I probably need to scoop back or maybe build like a foot platform. So that way I can press off. Still be quite a ways from uh, the pulley. So that way I can actually fully extend my arms all the way out, but I'll adjust it. Like I said, it's my first session with it, but I enjoy it. Oh man, yeah, that was much better. So I put my power block dumbbell right here, uh, just a, so like a foot plate pretty much. And that was a lot better. You can see that I'm having to reach for the attachment 
as opposed to, you know, stopping short. So I can fully, you know, let my shoulder blades uh, protract before I retract, which is what, you know, I like. Um, I'm definitely going to have a float plate created similar to this, probably with some 2x4s or something. I'm going to reach out to, to my guy who does a lot of welding and stuff for me. But, yeah, I like it. So I'm going to give you all one last shot of the final product. That cord runs up to there. Super easy to make. All right, that is the final product of this project that I did do it yourself garage gym style. It was super awesome. Like I said, I really enjoy it. After I made that minor adjustment to the foot plate, I think it's going to be a real game changer. This is something that I've always wanted, so I'm glad that I finally have it because something like adding a low row attachment to a lat pull down machine, if you were to buy something like that from a big brand, you know, fitness company, it would cost anywhere from like $500 to $700 more than what the price already costs. And lat pull down machines are already pretty expensive. So I'm glad to save a little bit of money where I can. I'm going to put links to everything that I purchased down in the description so you all can go get it yourself. And if you do try it out, please let me know how it goes. I'd love to hear from you guys. But if you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and subscribe and smash that like button to help me out a little bit. And until next time, stay strong.